is a tag team bout set for one fall with a 20 minute time limit. Introducing first, B. Priestley. Joining her, Emmy Sakura. Well, what the pair are these two ladies? Highly skilled, no doubt about that. Certainly, Big Priest has had her issues here in AEW with Dr. Britt Baker. We've certainly uh, reported that. Still ongoing, quite frankly. And this is the teacher of Rio. Yes, this is Emi Sakura, the legendary Japanese women's professional wrestler. Why, why is she a legend? Tell me, explain to us that don't know. She has, she has won championships in multiple, multiple promotions. She has started her own promotion, and she has trained some of the preeminent women's wrestlers in the world today, Riho included. That's the man. Best of the business there, Tony. He's the man, buddy. And their opponents first, from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Dr. Britt Baker, D. D. I, I, I think this is an amazing story, Rick Baker is, and an equally as amazing story is what we saw a week ago with Rio winning the championship. Absolutely, man, that was an upset in my book. Here comes a champ. Listen to the ovation. And her tag team partner, Rashigan Gawas, City Japan, she is the new AEW Women's World Champion. What a heart, what resilience. Never say die. She doesn't realize she's always going to be probably the smallest competitor in any given match. Very much so. Riho is used to overcoming larger opponents for her entire career. And actually, if you notice Riho's record when it flashed up on the bottom of the screen, the only blemish on that record came from when she was teaming with Dr. Brick Baker DMD. So it'll be interesting to see if they've been able to. Uh, you know, to, to work out some of the kinks in their, their tag team game. They're not a regular unit. They're, they're an impromptu tag team. But here tonight, there's a lot of uh, a lot of underlying ramifications here. We have the, the hostility between B. B Priestley and Britt Baker, and then the teacher versus student aspect of Emi Sakura and Riho. Well, Sakura has 24 years experience in the ring, and that may be the the factor in this match, yeah, more than anything else. She's probably not going to make too many mistakes. That's right. Uh, we'll see how, that, how it all plays out. That's why they have the matches here. The bell just sounded. We're underway. One fall, 20. Referee Aubrey Edwards drawing the duties. Yeah, she's so good. Done such a good job. Of course, uh, Rich and Pittsburgh were going to be there. Uh, coming up very soon, as a matter of fact. Yeah, October 23rd. Peterson Event Center. That's right. That's where the Pitt Panthers play. That's where we're going to be. And tickets are on sale at AEWTix.com. To go to Pittsburgh. I will have it for many for the sandwich. Thank you very much. Oh, Emi Sakura, very well acquainted with working, Rio's offense. I'm working by the hour, and Rio skates in a very athletic and flexible way. And JR, what a star making performance for Rio was in Washington, D.C. last week on Dynamite. Yeah, she made me a believer. I'll tell you, I, I thought that all along that, that Rio was just too small uh, to be. Miss Rose. Yeah, Nyla Rose making some uh, some unforced errors. Yeah, she did, and I just, I didn't see that coming. And, but this young woman's resilience, folks, as you watch her, you'll fall in love with her heart. But uh, that might not be enough tonight. Dr. Britt Baker giving Emmy Sakura a mouthful as B. Priestley. I saw what you did there. Dentist. See that, Tony? Yes, absolutely. Nothing gets by you, too. I, I, I think that if anyone underestimated, like oh, Tyler Rose may have done last week to Rio, no one's going to underestimate the champion again. Yeah, word is out. That's right. And uh, it's something that Emi Sakura has known for uh, for just about 13 years when she started training Rio when Rio was only nine years of age. Yeah, people, you heard right, ladies and gentlemen. Rio started training to be a pro wrestler at the age of nine. So if you wonder, how do you do that? Well, it ain't done in Oklahoma. Oh, she's a Japanese athlete. Just, they start early. Look at the strength here. The Romero special there by Emi Sakura. Just putting a lot of pressure on the knees and lower back of Riho and then dumping her. So the, the little lady's been isolated. The champ has been isolated. 
Look at this. Going right after Dr. Baker. What a cheap shot that was. And now look at Priestley and Baker hooking it up out here on the outside. You can tell there's no love lost as they're they're striking with all the power that they have. And good grief. And JR, it was it was a cheap shot that started all the hostility between B. Priestley and Brett Baker. New fast press. Now raining right hands on the head of Priestley. And the referees have done a good job of being somewhat lenient. Because nobody's gonna get paid on the outside here tonight. Oh, look at that shot. Nice. Chris, short form. Actually, I think Aubrey Evers does a great job as a referee. Me too. That's, she is sensational. She's using discretion, right? And, and officials can do that. And they had that opportunity. Some of them just don't have any damn common sense. And Emmy, Emmy Sakura identifying that her partner is in trouble. Heading to the outside. Now Britt Baker in jeopardy. Oh, double sit flips on the outside. Baker's body bouncing off the, that thin man. Oh, but Rio. Yeah, she's illegal. She's illegal. Up within the oh. This match continues when we come back on TNT. Two, Emmy Sakura breaks up the pinfall attempt. Following a DDT, a near fall. Emmy Sakura breaking up that pinfall attempt on her partner, keeping her team alive in this matchup. Well, if she drags her partner to the corner, uh, to Sakura. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Pretty small. Oh, yeah, that was. That's a veteran oh, move. That was a solid, solid tag team move. Hard knife head shot. Double underhook into the backbreaker. Knife head shot, but serving of a woo. In Bean Town, as the great Gorilla Monsoon used to say to me. What is she doing? The chance of Sakura. Right, but she's burning daylight. She's burning a lot of daylight, man. Oh! Cross body, nowhere to go for the doctor. I guess you're a 24-year vet, you know what you're doing. I guess, oh, look at that. Going out from the Vader bomb into the senton to Britt Baker, though, able to kick out. Is that what that's called now, a Vader bomb? That is so cool. <laughs> that is. They were gonna call it the Leon White bomb. It <laughs> didn't quite work, work as That well. is so cool. Oh, oh, look at that, a little stunner. Nicely done. That cutter was well done by, by the doctor. Emmy Sakura, though. Oh, rapid fire shots. That, that thudding chop. Riho intercepts, rolls through. She's so quick. Stop oh, the midsection. Both feet so right to the abdomen. Brick with a swinging neck breaker. Hooks the leg, far side. Can she hold her? No. no. Oh. She thought she had her. Aubrey Edwards was right there with the eye on the shoulders. Hey guys, Nashville's coming up soon. Legendary arena. Yes, We're sir. gonna be there. Municipal Auditorium. Yeah. See a lot of great action. AEWTix.com. And I am having me some hot chicken. Emi Sakura repeated shots from the knee. Upward, upward rising knee strikes. Ripcord out into that elbow strike. Emi Sakura on roller skates. Bernesa hooked up into the neck breaker. Rolls through into the stretch, and now submission time. Submission time, Doc. Can you hold it? Can you keep those hands locked? I think there's too much oh. power. Under. Look at this. Go to the jaw, and that is it. Emmy Sakura taps out. A real business using a real mandible claw. What the hell is happening? I didn't think she could hold her down. But then when she reached in to the jaw, that changed everything. When you see Amy Sakura clutching that jaw, that was the difference maker. And now in consecutive weeks, Dr. Britt Baker, DMD, picking up victories in tag team competition. You have to wonder if she has her sights set on the woman that is her partner, that is the champion. Here's what I want to see right or, here. I'll be Priestley. Yeah, this, this is the one. This got some magic to it, ladies and gentlemen. The doctor and B. Priestley. And, uh, and Aubrey Edwards separating Priestley. The referee did a great job there, not trying to manhandle, using her voice commands, but you got the talent still got to listen. The athletes still have to listen to the official. And sometimes the, you got to just take some money from them. How about the world champion getting involved in this? I know. Personal. I, she could get injured in there. Good job by the referee. Yeah. Nice work. And a nice tag team matchup, quite frankly. 
Yeah, this Deep Priestley, Dr. Baker thing is going to get really, really good before it's all said and done. And you know that every woman on the roster wants to meet uh, Riho. Her attendance here. Everybody's watching. There's no question. Here's a look once again. This is where it really broke down on the outside, and we thought that our referee did a great job. Letting the match continue yeah. and not counting anyone out. The world champion is just so fluid, but in the end, of all the great maneuvers and fluidity that we saw from Rio, it was this from Dr. Britvig. There you go. And Emmy Sakura would be forced to tap out by the good doctor.